Have you ever thought about switching your mobile carrier but got bogged down with info? Well, you're in the right place. Today, we'll be talking about how easy it is with some examples from Verizon. Let's get to it. So, you've heard the rumors, right? Switching carriers seems like a huge expense and a hassle with the fear of losing all your data. Well, let's talk about that. First, regarding the cost. Most are worried about the fees that come with breaking a contract and any outstanding payments on their device. But here's the truth. If you fulfilled your contractual obligations and own your device outright, the only fee that comes with switching is a $30 activation fee. However, if you haven't fully paid off your device, it may be locked to your previous carrier, which means you'll need to settle any remaining dues and get it unlocked before making the switch. Next up is the notion that switching is a long, drawn-out process. With Verizon's streamlined two-step process, you'll be up and running in no time. We'll cover that in a bit. And let's not forget the big one, the fear of losing all your data. Contacts, photos, you name it. But don't worry. Best Buy offers data transfer services to ensure all your digital treasures make the journey with you. Now that we've busted some misconceptions, let's talk about why switching to Verizon at Best Buy is straightforward. Love your current phone? No problem. You can keep your phone and your number when you switch. With Verizon and Best Buy, it's easy as one, two, three. Actually, just one, two. First things first, you'll need to provide some basic information. We're talking about your customer billing account number, or BAN, the phone numbers you're switching over, and your personal identification number, or PIN, from your current carrier. It's crucial to have these details accurate to ensure a smooth transition. Once your information is all set, the port-in process is next. This is where your number gets transferred to Verizon. It could take up to 24 hours, but the good news is you won't lose service during this time. Your current phone will still receive calls and texts until the port is complete. And that's it. Two simple steps. Now, let's talk about the flexibility of unlocked phones and how they fit into this whole switching scenario. Unlocked phones are all the rage these days, and for good reason. They give you the freedom to choose your carrier without being tied down. If you're buying an unlocked phone from Best Buy, activating it with Verizon at the time of purchase can lead to instant savings. The amount varies by device and current promotions, so check in store or online for the latest deals. Already have an unlocked phone? No worries. With the bring your own device option, you can activate your phone on Verizon's network at a Best Buy store. And here's another thing. BYOD can come with bill credit promotions. Again, check in store or online for the most current offers. So. Whether buying a new unlocked phone or bringing your own, Verizon and Best Buy make it a breeze to get activated and enjoy your new service. Here are some final points to consider. Remember, you're responsible for any remaining balance or device payments with your current carrier. Make sure to settle those before making the switch. Don't be surprised when you see your first Verizon bill. It will be slightly higher due to the one-time activation fee. And there you have it. If you found this video helpful, give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more tech tips from Best Buy. And if you like further recommendations, head to bestbuy.com to shop with an expert. Click the link below to connect with an expert or to set up an in-store appointment. Thanks for watching. <laughs>